Hi guys, it's Deborah from Time with Joe by Deborah. Today we are opening up a thread up 15 piece. This is box three of nine. So far I've had seven delivered. Waiting on the other two. So, so far so good. This was ordered November 4th. Out of here, move the box. <clears throat> and let's see what lovely we have today. All right, got some extra baggies, some extra air pillows. All right, so here is a first look. Jump them out. It looks like earrings, earrings, a ring. All right, so what I will do is take these all out of the bag and then we will go through these piece by piece. All right, I'll be right back. Hello, my lovelies. Okay, so we got everything out and as I always do, putting my little note, this is box three of nine from the Thread Up 15 piece. I do have Pressy out and I do have the gold and silver testing for some items and we have some lovely pieces so hmm where to start let's start with the Carol Lee piece this is a vintage Carol Lee four strand these are beautiful soft beige with gold tone and just look at this lovely cap that is just gorgeous. There is the Carol Lee. Let me get the measurements on her. She is great. The comps for these are anywhere from $150 down. So, I want you guys to get a good deal. So, we're going to give you a great price. We all want to save a little money, right? So, the wearable length is 6. This is just outstanding. Let's do this four strand Carolee for, let's do 35. Oh, I love that piece. All right. Next up, let's do, hmm, we'll do this beautiful green necklace. This is fashion. These are plastic on gold tone. Beautiful faceted stones. This is the and there, nice extender size. The extender is two and a quarter. Let's move her and get a measurement. As it sits, it is a seven and a half. That's pretty. Let's do her since she's fashion for five. All right. What earrings should we do next? All right, let's do these. These are really sweet. Yellow beaded, gold tone hoops. I just love that dash of color, especially now while it's snowy and dark and rainy. Ugh. All right. These measure in at two and a half inches. These are sweet. Let's do these hoops for three. All right, next up, these are J. Crew. These are just stunning color blue beads. I like them a lot. I'm going to move this out of the way. Get you a measurement on one. So it would hang down to two and a half inches. Here is the J. Crew marking on the back. These are gorgeous. Blue and white. Another pop of color. Let's do these lovelies for... Let's do them for three. All right. Next up, I got a lot of earrings in this one. These are gold tone. Leaf with a leaf over it. Those are really pretty. Let's measure these. They have a hang down of two inches. Oh. Those are just classic and really lightweight. Let's do these for two. 
All right. These are fun. I love these earrings. Green, lighter blue, and a darker blue. Beaded, and they are faceted. They are hoop, uh, for pierced ears. They are two and three quarter inches long. Oh, I love these. Let's do these lovelies for $3. So I hope everyone is having a safe start to the new, to the new year. Oh my goodness. To the holiday season. I am staying as safe as I can. Staying in a lot. Doing a lot of my shopping online and early. All right. These are heavy. Gold tone. And these are triangular faceted stones. Here is the back. Let me get you a measurement on that. They are just under one and a half inches. And these are RMN gold tone triangle rhinestone earrings. Let's do these for five. All right, next up. We have a silver tone pair of dangle earrings with greens, blues, purples, and pink stones. They are faceted. Oh, there's a lot of shine. I hope you guys can see the sparkle on these gorgeous earrings. For these earrings, let's do let's do three, and they measure in at two inches. Okay, next up are these lovely heavy tone. They, they look like J. Crew. They are not marked, but my guess is, is that they might be. They are really beautiful and heavy. They are just over two and a half inches, black, clear, brown, and these are a milky white rhinestone. These earrings measure in at two and a half inches. Let's do these for, let's do those for six. Next up, we have a sweet pair of new Anthropology Bobbles Bijou Bits and Bobs Fandangles Notions. <laughs> That's a mouthful. Look at those. Oh, how precious are those? That stone, it, oh, and color. They were originally 38. This is a leather tag. They measure in at half of an inch. Oh, I really love these. Let's do these for $5. I'd make a great gift. All right, up next we have a brown leather crossed over bracelet. It's got adjustable sizing. It would measure in at about an eight to an eight and a half inch. That's sweet. I really like this. Different. This leather bracelet, let's do that one for Two. All right, next up we have a Chico's bracelet. It is seven inches. Magnetic clasp here. And all these pieces here, there's the Chico's tag, and these have Chico's on them as well. Oh, that is lovely. Look at that beautiful piece. Chico's makes such beautiful jewelry. So for this charm bracelet, let's do eight. All right, now to the jewelry that we need to test. This is a Charming, Charming Charlie gold tone. These look like quartz. They feel like quartz, and they are nice and cold. Let me bring Pressy in. Move her over so you can see her. And we are looking to make sure that these are quartz. Here we go. Sure enough, they are quartz. This is a gorgeous necklace. I just love quartz. I use it a lot in my personal life. I just absolutely love quartz being around me. So for this charming Charlie necklace, oh, you guys need a measurement. Huh. I guess that would help. Let's see here. The necklace measures in at an eight inch drop. For the charming Charlie Let's do, oh, it's so gorgeous. Let's do 12 on that. All right. Next up, we have a beautiful, oh, look at this garnet. Garnet is my birthstone. I am a January baby. 
I am going to try to see if we can test this. All right. These are small beads, so sometimes they slip off. So let's see if we can get one here. Can you guys see that, I hope? I'll bring it down. All right, and we're looking for garnet, which is right there. And sure enough, they are garnet. This is just absolutely beautiful necklace. If I didn't have some garnet myself, I would keep this one because you know what? Mama needs to take care of herself every once in a while, right? <laughs> All right, let's see. Yeah, make sure you guys buy yourself a gift, an extra gift this year because you know what? We work hard and we deserve pretty things. Life is short. All right, so this is a 12 and a half inch wearable length, stunning garnet necklace. Oh, it's heavy. Let's do this for 25. All right, now we're gonna bring out the stone. Now this looks like sterling silver. It could be alpaca. I didn't see any markings, but that doesn't mean that it's not been marked and, and worn off. So what we're gonna do is test this. It's a beautiful inlay with shell. So we're going to rub the side of this pendant. All right, and then we are going to rub here. If I can get a good angle at it. All right. We're going to test to see if this is silver. Now, alpaca is not silver. It looks like silver, but it is not. That is not a good scratch. But they call it alpaca silver. I love alpaca. All right, so let's test this with the 18 karat. If it is sterling, it should come up as blue all right it looks like it has eaten the line so I am just gonna feel safe saying that this is silver tone it could be alpaca beautiful inlaid stone there measures in at seven and three quarters oh that is lovely let's do this one for ten dollars all right <clears throat> now this is gorgeous it, it this is a gold vermeil over sterling silver this piece is by lucy williams and it's called the waffle ring i call it the woven ring so we are going to go ahead and test over here oops Make you guys shake if I do it that way. All right. Now we're going to do the 18 karat to see if it gets blue, which it should because it's sterling silver. And it is turning a beautiful blue. All right. And it's supposed to be 18 karat gold over. Let me pop that air bubble. And it is not eating away over here at the line. But I am going to test it also with the 14 karat. Let's take a peek here. The line is still there. So this is an 18 karat gold over sterling vermeil ring i will get you a size here her rings are beautiful absolutely love this ring gold tone let's get a measurement on this lovely oh. i can almost break out in a stevie wonder song <laughs> you guys know what i mean all right it's a five and a half isn't that beautiful so I know she sold out on all her on the website for these. Um, I might have a ring box that if, if if this is a gift idea, then I could put it and see if I can find a ring box. If not, I do have a box that I could put it in. For this ring, let's say, hmm, 
let's say 45 that's gorgeous all right you guys let me know what your favorite piece is mine's the garnet because i'm a january baby and i just love this color that and i really really like the charming charlie necklace so you guys leave a comment let me know what your favorite pieces are if you're interested in any other items just shoot me an email at timelessjewel by Deborah at gmail.com and I can get you a PayPal invoice and I will gladly hold items for a week if you want to continue shopping so that way we can save you some money and you guys are the best. I really appreciate you all being here and supporting my small business. We are going to take care of each other in our YouTube community so you guys have a great day. Thanks so much. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing down there. <laughs> Hit the thumbs up. And you guys, be well. Have a good one. Bye.